artist in a circus moves around a hexagonal path of 20 meter side in such a way that for the first 20 meter he moves with a speed of 20 meter per second then for another 20 meters he moves with a speed of 10 meter per second and then for remaining path he moves with an alternative speed that is 20 meter per second and 10 meter per second find his average speed so an interesting question but i'm sure solution is not going to be complex i mean it looks to be a typical question type where you have to do a lot of stuff but it's it's one single step solution in my view if you, if you understand what's actually happening here so there's a hexagonal path the side is 20 meters right it is 20 meters so basically a regular hexagon where each side is 20 meters now an artist is moving along this around this hexagonal path so what he does is for the first 20 meters he moves at the speed of 20 meter per second so let's assume he has started from this point this starting point he is moving in this direction at what speed 20 meter per second then for another 20 meters that means this 20 meters he moves at 10 meter per second and then he alternates between 20 meters and 10 meters for the remaining path so which means he covers this path at 20 meter per second then this one at 10 meter per second then this one at 20 meter per second and then this one at 10 meter per second you understand he's alternating between 10 20 10 20 so 20 10 20 10 20 10 he, and we have been asked to find out the average speed what is the average speed see if you see the the shape doesn't really matter the shape of the path doesn't really matter it, overall i would say he has covered see each side is 20 meters so there are three sides which he has covered at 20 meter per second so basically 3 into 20 60 meters has been covered at 20 meter per second and then 3 into 10 which is 30 meters has been covered at 10 meter per second you understand 60 meters of the journey oh sorry sorry 3 into 20 again 60 meters of the journey total 120 meters right total distance covered is 120 20 times 6 is 120 so out of that 120 60 meters he has covered at 20 meters per second and another 60 meters he has covered at 10 meters per second that is it done you know that when the distance covered is equal it's like going from point a to point b and then coming back so let's assume it is like this 60 meters is the length one person goes from a to b at what speed 20 meters per second and goes back from b to a at what speed 10 meters per second what is the average speed you know that when the total distance covered is equal in both the paths in in both the journeys then average speed is 2 s1 s2 by s1 plus s2 and it is this case only 2 s1 s2 by s1 plus s2 where s1 and s2 are the individual speeds so when you have covered one length at s1 and the same length as s2 then the average speed will be 2 s1 s2 by s1 plus s2 so here 2 into speeds are 20 and 10 respectively right so 2 into 20 into 10 by 20 plus 10 so it's like 200 400 400 by 30 400 by 30 will be 13.33 13.33 meters per second option one and then you solve it yourself you should not be drawing all this in the exam right don't waste your time and all, all this stuff don't write the formula don't draw this a b and all that the only step that you put on paper should be this in fact this also is not needed you should be able to do the calculation mentally that it should be six uh, sorry 400 by 30 which is 13. 33 meters per second.